Hey folks, Keith with 93 Lumber coming back at you with another beer. This is Muckraker. It's another Muckraker beer. Uh, this is the second beer that they did with uh, 12%. They have that contract now. Um, and yeah, or at least the second one that was distributed, at least. Uh, this is Dusk of Man Imperial Stout. It is 12% alcohol by volume. Um, <clears throat> says best before March 2024 so yeah I wonder who did the uh, who created this uh, label um, yeah I picked this up earlier today uh, I've been looking for it well Technically, I found it at the second place I looked. Um, but, yeah. Looks like a stout. And technically, I've had this before. Because um, he uh, he's brewed it at his brewery. And um, I've had it there. <clears throat> um, but this is this is brewed at 12%. So, let's see. It, it is really dark. I'm not really getting... Maybe maybe a little bit of brown in there, but that's that's dark. That's about half a finger of a pretty like coffee with a splash of a splash of milk in it. Kinda. Yeah. And I'm getting wafts of chocolate and, and marshmallow? I don't know. Let's see what it smells like. Closer in, I'm not getting as much chocolate as I thought I was going to. I mean, there's still chocolate in it. But there's actually more of a, uh, a roasty bitterness. Yeah, but there's a, there's a nice, <clears throat> there's a nice a tw tinge, twinge whatever that word is, of, of sweetness in there. Hmm. It smells good. It's probably a little bit colder than I would prefer it, but, you know. I had it in the beer fridge, so it's not super cold or anything. Um, let's see what it tastes like. Cheers. Super smooth. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> in the aroma, there was a chocolate thing, and then there was a roasty bitterness thing. Uh, and it was kind of, it was a bit separate. Um, in the taste, it comes off more cohesive. Not that the aroma was not cohesive, just it it comes uh, it comes across as more like cacao nibs or uh, like a dark chocolate. But there is also like a sweet, a sweeter chocolate thing in there. Yeah, this is, this is really good. It was, I think I had, I think, I think it was, it was either last year or the year before, I think, that I had it at Muckraker. Or maybe it was before, before that. I don't remember, but um, I don't really remember. Yeah, um, <clears throat> every once in a while I get this like, um, 
every once in a while it comes across there's like a little bit of like russian imperial stout thing that comes across um not not as bitter as that but but it's 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 cool cuz on one sip i get this like nice uh like sweet chocolate with a little bit of bitterness and then another sip i get like a more bitter bittering thing i like that i mean it may not come across uh like that to some people but that's the way it's coming across right now yeah that roastiness is Based on the aroma, I thought the roast, that roasty, the bitterness is there, but that, but the roastiness is not as big as I, I, I thought it was going to be, um, based on the nose. It actually comes across more in the, uh, in like the aftertaste. Um, yeah, uh, Muckraker, one of my favorite breweries. I haven't been there in a while. Uh, we're actually going, um, we're, we are go. they're having a, uh, a drag show thing for St. Patty's Day, St. Pa Patrick's Day. I keep hearing people say St. Patty's Day, <laughs> St. Patrick's Day or whatever the fuck it is. I don't know. Um, <clears throat> and yeah, so that's this Friday, I believe. Um, so Katie and I and her sister and her husband are are uh we're all gonna go so it's gonna be the first time going to muckraker in a while um looking forward to it um but yeah i know this got di i know this one i don't know if the the hazen got distro as much as this one did but i know i saw a post about uh uh tom was sharing posts like it, it it's like in oregon and california and stuff like that so if uh you should you should look out for this or follow muckraker on on the on the internet and you can uh find out where where it landed yeah um so yeah i hope you're all doing well take care of yourself take care of each other you can like this video if you'd like to subscribe to the channel if you have not already you can follow me on instagram 93 lumber that's spelled out 93 lumber We'll see you in the next one. Cheers.